Have you ever thought that your app looks a bit flat? Yeah, sure, you can add animations, micro interactions, some feedback, but in the end it always feels like the interaction with the app looks flat. Fortunately, the answer is simpler than you think. The trick lies behind the React Native Haptic Feedback Pattern. You can install it in your app by simply running yarn add React Native Haptic Feedback. On iOS, always remember to run pod install from the iOS folder. And there it is, ready to be used. Define the onpress function to handle the tab, import the package in your React Native app, and implement just the trigger method. The types of haptic feedback you have at your disposal are countless. Impact light, medium, heavy, rigid, soft, notification success, and so on and so forth. To get started, I recommend you simply start with impact light. Connect the onpress function to the touchable and you will immediately notice a huge improvement in the user experience. If on some versions of Android or iOS you don't notice the expected behavior, keep in mind that the trigger function accepts as a second parameter a set of options related to the operating system. If your app is initialized with Expo, you can simply handle the haptic feedback by launching Expo install Expo Haptics. Want to learn more? Don't forget to check out the links in the video description. Thanks a lot for watching this video and remember to subscribe to the channel for more content.